Hello everybody, this is Alex, and today guys, um, based on the title of this video, you're probably a little concerned for my financial budget, but I do have a plan, is, and hopefully I make as much money um, back as I do spend after maybe an hour. I'll, so what I'll do guys, is this video will take a while, but what I'll do is after I purchase all the spawners that I'm going to purchase, I'm actually going to go an AFK for about an hour to see how much money I get back. But guys, so, my, now you're probably like, after I've explained all that, you're probably still like, what the heck, Alex? Huh? It's because of this. If I do slash shop, spawners. Villager spawners are 4,800,000 each. Now, I can get about a hundred, just under a hundred of those, so... Let me see exactly how many I can purchase. So, I could purchase, um, okay, check, still check. Oh my gosh, I could purchase... Okay, guys, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to purchase... Nine stacks of villager spawners. <laughs> okay, guys, so, yeah, I'm only at, like, one billion now, but, um... So, nine stacks of villager spawners, that's a lot. I don't sure exactly how much that is. But guys, also some new things is um are that um I have a goblin rank. So if you if you don't have a rank, if you subscribe to my YouTube channel, and with so if you subscribe to my YouTube, if you're subscribed to my YouTube channel, and leave a comment on this video, and you put you have to put your Minecraft name. But then if you put I have no rank, then you will receive this rank as the prize. Otherwise, you will get the fly perk as the first person. 300 by 300 extension for the next two people, then Ender Spars and Zombie Pigment Spars. Um, I'm not sure why these two won't stack for some reason. It's really weird. But guys, I'm planning on um, I don't, I'm now I'm not sure if I should um, just like you know take like this this current setup I have going and just you know I'm actually gonna save some space. Um, However, here's the thing though, I, eventually I am going to have to um, reshape this, because I want I want to stick with the mushroom, I want to try to stick with the mushroom thing as much as possible. Now, I could just build a giant mushroom, which I might just do. You know, that's what I'm going to do, I'll just spend like, hours upon hours AFK here, and because this is very much my AFK spot, so what I'll do, yeah, you know, I'm just going to just, um, put the spawners in here, and then what I'll do is, um, at some point, I'll just destroy it as much as possible, try, and try to, um, well, I'll try to, like, you know, bake, like, based off of this basic shape, that will probably, that, that will probably be, like, the bottom part, like, the widest part, it'll be, like, a couple blocks, it'll go up, and then out, so maybe he'll be a little bit taller than that one. I don't know. But this is pretty much where I'm going to... I'm gonna, first off, I'm going to need some blocks. Uh, do I have any blocks that aren't spawners? Um, hold on. Let me just eat some food real quick. Let me just eat some food real quick. There we go. See, yeah, um, I'm not rich. I, I'm not rich on this server that I could just up and eat. What the... I did not just jump there. Wait, hold on. Is auto jump on? That that accidentally uh, accident guys, hold on. Uh, do do controls auto jump should be off always. I never use auto jump. It's annoying. It's it's only good when playing Pocket Edition. But anyway, so let me just break that. So this is where a creeper spawner is situated. I'm gonna put that block there, that block there, so that way they don't spawn. And then I'm gonna place a villager spawner there. I'm gonna see if any villagers will spawn now. I'm gonna break this block. Will villagers spawn? There's some creepers. Will villagers spawn now? Yes, villagers will spawn. Okay, cool. So, so what I might do is, um, I'm just gonna spend a lot of time. Is it, it has to be a faster way to do this. This feels faster. 
Um, so I'm just gonna... I have a lot more of these to do. But look at that. I'm getting 43 villagers. Um, let me check my balance real quick. So, honestly, guys, like, look at all that lapis. I'm actually gonna go to the lava, because it doesn't... I don't take any damage. I'm going to throw the lapis into the hoppers. Did, is the lapis, like, flooding the hoppers or something? Uh, I... If, if so, I'm going to need to replace these with higher level hoppers um, very fast. But guys, let me just show you guys. So in the shop, if you go into the shop, oh wait, wrong button. If you go here, lapis sells for a hundred each. So if I'm getting stacks upon stacks of it. So you know, I'm just going to spam this button for a while, and I'll be back once I've put nine stacks worth of villagers in here. And I'll show you how many um, individual villagers I can actually get. Okay, guys, so... Um, <laughs> so, guys, it turns out I actually got managed to put 600 spawners there. And um, so my money, I feel like... It, uh, I actually had to add a couple, but um, let me just slash hopper, because that's how you use these. So what you do is you go like that and shablam, uh, huh? Now you go like that and then bam, you get a tier one hopper. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to take out all the items. Right, I'm gonna break the hopper. I'm gonna break the hopper. I'm gonna go into the top. I'm, I'm pretty sure you can. I can get in through this area. area. Yeah, but I, I, I had so many, um, things. There's so many things. Like, I'm pretty sure this hopper is now, like, sucking everything up and with the increased rate. That's just a regular hopper. But, um, what I'm going to have to do, though, is I'm actually going to get a bunch of tier 3 hoppers. As well. Because I have a lot of these now. And, um... So let me just uh, do 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 fill that up. This is going to be really crazy slash hopper because these suck up all items in the trunk ten times the default transfer rate. Um, I'm gonna go with six. I could do. I don't have to do this out here. So I'm gonna put one there. That way I have multiple hoppers. I'll put one there. And there. And there. And there. And there. So I'm going to need... Okay, there we go. So let me check. Is this a that's the regular that's tier three? Okay, cool. That's that's also regular. So that's a tier one. I might replace that one actually because I have enough to do that. Okay, yeah. So ten times default transfer transfer rate. I'm pretty sure these also automatically oh there's some hoppers in there yeah and these are still somehow full is this, how is this one staying full of item oh gosh I'm just gonna like there we go Oh, there's that hopper charm I was looking for. Okay. Wait, yeah, there's tier three. Bam. So, guys, this seems to be kind of insane, actually. Um, you do slash balance. Okay, yeah, I might need more hoppers. I might just need an, a secondary killing method. I don't know. 
But one thing I do know for sure is that this is going to get me a lot of money, I hope. Um, first off, let me just fill this up. I might actually need to... Um, how many poppies is this? Oh my gosh. Yeah, so... Um, <laughs> maybe this was a little bit too much of a um, like sudden... It's like a sudden influx of money, but like, you know what, let me just, um, this is a lot quicker. I mean, they don't sell for much, but I did not know villagers drop poppies. I thought that was just, um, other things, but like, look at that, it's like, it's climbing rapidly, and there's like, I mean, they're not full of anything at the moment, but this one is then like it vanishes i think it's because these all every single hopper is trying to sell them but it's also pushing them into the chest but look at that see it's like 400 villagers that's like and then it goes up to 600 before they can even die and then 800 and they finally they finally they, yeah they finally managed to actually die but, I mean, look, slash, balance. I'm pretty sure the balance updates for these sort of things every couple, like, every minute, couple minutes. So, I'm going to put that tier 1 hopper charm away. Um, some of those regular hoppers away. The tier 1 hopper. But, guys, honestly, this was a pretty short episode. But, um, I still need you guys to leave a comment. Um, and also, su suggesting what to use this space for. Should I use this as an island level increasing area, or should I turn it into a cactus farm? Now, I know that cactus isn't very useful, so I'm pretty sure that if you guys don't say anything, if you guys, unless I get a very strong yes to make to making a making it a cactus farm, it's just gonna be a chunk completely filled up with. I'm gonna see if I could just fill this entire chunk up with end portal frames. Then maybe maybe I'll like you know do that like with like the next chunk over I'll try to fill it with sponges or something and maybe I'll try I'll do fun stuff like that I'll try to fill an entire chunk up with beacons maybe but guys um so here's the thing so each of those villagers drops hundreds and thou like probably thousands of lapis each one's worth a hundred so I get I mean this is gonna be a massive money like if I was to relog. I might be probably a lot higher than 1.62 billion. Like, I'm trying to check my balance. And the creepers pretty much are nothing at this anymore. The creepers are nothing anymore. The villagers are where they are. Wait, could I, like, trade with the villagers? Or are they, like, not tradable? Okay, yeah. So, it's, it's confirmed you can't trade with the villagers. That'd be pretty cool, honestly, if you could. Cause then I would just have like a million villagers just sort of like separate, like, you know. But um, I'm actually gonna do some more routine things, just to check up on everything. And um, so yeah, guys. Um, if you have any ideas for like, cause I'm, I want to see if I can use like logs of a certain type. Wait, is this like? This is the wrong dirt. Pretty sure that's the wrong. Yeah, it's coarse dirt still. What the heck is that doing there? Where's all my regular dirt? Where's all my seriously? Wh where the heck did all my regular dirt go? Do I need more regular dirt? It doesn't matter. I it's like literally just two dollars for two dirt. I mean, see, I remember. I'm pretty sure like dirt should really be more expensive on a sky block. But, then again, who am I to say anything like that? But anyway, guys, so my island level updated is 25,520. And, um, one thing I am going to try to do is I'm pretty much going to just, like, flatten the entire thing full of dirt in one episode. And then, may then I'll probably actually, I'll go, like, maybe one or two blocks full of just, con of just solid dirt throughout the entire 300 by 300. And then I'll have, like, a special thing to go to the underside of the island, where I'll probably just do a lot of things like this. I'll have a bunch of chunks, and I'll fill them up with, um, you know, 
like sponge and stuff like that because if I get like a million of these a million of sponges imagine a million sponges this thing that you actually like you can't like purchase sponge there should be like a thing that should be a thing if anyone from the actual Minesucker server you should be I feel like there should be like a island level up shop where, they, where there's like you know like you can purchase for like in game money for like yeah, you know, like tens or hundreds of billions of dollars, you could purchase for like you know ten like for a billion dollars, you can purchase an end portal frame. Ten billion, you can purchase a sponge or something like that. Cause I feel like that is something that is needed. Then again, the people that at they're at the about the top balance, where they have in the what is this like one two million billion in like the two trillions of dollars. Maybe that wouldn't be the best idea, actually. But, but guys, yeah, this has maybe been a short episode, but... Honestly, if you guys want to see me do some other things, please, like... If you want to, you can always just put donations into the donation hopper. This is what this is now. It's also collecting cactus, but... It's technically, I like to call... I feel like it's a, it, should, it could be a donation hopper, if you guys really want it to be. You guys could drop things at my island. Um, I still have seven minions, which... I don't really know, like, you know, how useful that would be. I don't know how useful minions would be at the moment. Unless you're going to use them as, like... Is there a way I can use a minion as a, um... What are the modes? There's cell mode, farm mode, idle mode, load chunks mode. How do you do that? How do you upgrade, like... Seriously, if anyone knows how about load chunks mode, please tell me exact. Please tell me um, what, like, how that would be done. Because I would love to have a menu in load chunks mode, just sitting over there the entire time, and that way I can just sort of AFK wherever the heck I want, and you know. You, but you know, but guys, um, another thing I'm thinking. That maybe I should try to do is well, maybe guys and guys. So I'm going to try to bring this idea back where I do some sort of. Um, if and so guys, another thing you should subscribe for is if you guys want to see me and Tango, who is up in the corner. Yes, I honestly had no idea if he was here or not. But so yeah, if me and Tango, if you guys want to see me and him do something, please t alert tell him that I want to do something with him. I do not think he has, well, has watched my videos. But, um, but yeah, it, so if you guys want to see me and him do something, you should contact him in the comment section of his videos, let him know that I want, I want to, you know, do some sort of survival type thing, maybe, and, you know, maybe, maybe one of these, another island, I don't know, but, I feel like there'll be something really fun. Without any further ado, guys. I like thank you all very much for watching this video. Make sure you like and subscribe for more. And I'll see you guys next time.